I am installing dashcam into my car and I want to use this custom made do-it-yourself power supply for the dashcam that's easy to install and it's a clean installation. Everything will be under the dashboard and there will be no need um, to cut any of the factory wires in the in the car. So basically what I have over here is a fuse tab. This is to, um, um, to get ignition hot uh, power supply from the car this small thing is for ground connection and when we have those two connected we have 12 volts but most um, most dash cams are powered with 5 volts so we need this DC to DC converter which will be soldered to the uh, to those two parts we have positive in and negative in over here and on the other side, uh, we will have our output voltage, which you can regulate with this uh, potentiometer over here. So we will uh, adjust it to be 5 volts and uh, solder two wires over here. And at the end, we have this USB port and plastic covers for it. And this bunch of parts um, uh, with some uh, wiring will create something like this, where you connect this to the ignition hot fuse. Over here you have the DC to DC converter, which you set to 5 volts. And over here you can connect USB cable that will power your uh, dash cam. So from these parts you can create something like this, which will help you a lot when installing new uh, new equipment in your car and in a minute I'm going to try to install it in my Golf Mark 7 to check if it's uh, working correctly. Oh, and I have to set it to 5 volts just to make sure it will not damage the dash cam. So I set it to 5 volts and now I can use this shrink tube to cover the cover the, the DC to DC converter so it's safe, it will not cause some short circuit under the dashboard. I removed this compartment, also removed the side trim. This is not necessary. I just want to have more light inside so I can better so I can better see what's going on over here. And if I remember correctly, this 10 amp fuse over here should be ignition hot. So if we use a tool like this to remove it and uh, replace it with our um, with our powering powering set, we should have ignition hot USB. Okay, now the now the negative. Maybe let's install it over here. Okay, ready. I have a little LED connected to the USB port. So let's turn the ignition. Let's turn the ignition on and let's check if it works. Okay. Cool, it works and and when I turn the ignition off, it's off. So this circuit, I believe, is, is ready to connect to your dashcam. Okay, give me a thumbs up if you like this tutorial. 
check my other tutorials about more interesting stuff for your car and subscribe for future videos. See you soon.